Good morning. It is 6.36 a.m. on Tuesday, August 30th, 2016. I am Christiana Ellis, and I just got up. This is five more minutes. So, I haven't been eating a very healthy diet over the last couple of days. I need to do better. Um, you know, it's not extreme or anything, but uh, it's just enough that I've kind of recognized it, and it's like, hmm. Yeah, need to straighten that out a little bit. Uh, get back under control. Lynn has found some sort of a wrapper in the kitchen. What are you doing in there, Linda? I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so just uh, over the weekend and then uh, yesterday, just a couple of days worth where... I'm really not eating healthy things. Um, so, yeah, I need to straighten that out. Uh, like uh, maybe get a salad for lunch today or something like that. Uh, you know, it's just part of a you know minor course correction now that I've noticed myself veering off a little bit. Uh, oh, boy, I just lost my train of thought. Uh, I also discovered uh, that uh, I went when I went to bed a little bit early last night. Um, I woke up today feeling a little bit less tired, and uh, that seems wrong. I better have to retry that experiment to see. Okay, this is what Luna had found: is that it's a fortune cookie, an empty fortune cookie wrapper. must have been on the on the table or something from the last time I had Chinese food um, which was just over the weekend incidentally it's not like <laughs> uh, it's not like oh yeah just a mystery trash wrapper that's sitting on the table um, God I just to totally scattered today uh, I think maybe it's just because I didn't have really coherent plan for what the I was going to talk about today. I feel like in yesterday's writing, this is a new change of subject, by the way, uh, yesterday's writing, uh, I w decided to, so one of my uh, novels in progress that it, I have rough draft mostly done with, um, but because I've been off of it for a while and because there's a significant change to the main character that I was planning to make, I decided to kind of go through and do new draft of what I've got before jumping back into finishing the ending of the rough draft. And I finally last night, I think, cracked the opening scene, which had always been troubling me a little bit just because... The character evolved over the course of writing the story to the point where the opening scene kind of didn't really work anymore. Uh, and it just felt awkward. Like I had an image for what I wanted the scene to be, but I couldn't quite figure out how to get there in a way that didn't feel clumsy. And I think I may have uh, cracked it last night. Uh, in the sense that I at least now have a version that I like better than what I had before. And this was a scene that I had kind of tried redrafting a couple of times, and I just sort of couldn't seem to find anything elegant to get there in. But uh, anyway, um, other news. Uh, I have recently discovered the Harmontown podcast. Uh, I jumped into it having heard about it before, but as much as I loved the Harmon Quest show on CISO that I've talked about, um, that just made me think, you know, I'm interested if this is kind of spun out of his podcast, I'm interested in his podcast. And wow, I really like the podcast. So I've actually kind of gotten a whole bunch of the back episodes too, uh, to listen to that. And it's, uh, it's good. I like it a lot. It's kind of uh, just one of those rambly conversational podcasts um, but, uh, uh, I don't know. I just really like the people they've got on there. It's, uh, it's really funny, I think. 
And so uh, listening to that a bunch, uh, and then last night after doing my writing for the day, uh, I jumped back into Saints Row the Third, which just remains an extremely silly and fun uh, video game to play. So, anyway, that's what I'm up to later this week. Um, on Wednesday night, I will be going to Herald Night, which is improv comedy related. Um, the improv class I'm taking right now is Advanced Herald, which is Herald, as a reminder, is it just a structure of, it's a type of improv show structure you can do. And so Herald Night on Wednesdays, I'll be seeing some other teams perform the Herald, you know, for, you know, instructional purposes. Or, you know, the show is just a show, but I'm going specifically to, uh, you know, talk about it later. Uh, I'm actually feeling marginally more awake, having gotten a little bit more sleep last night. But I am apparently just as scattered as ever. Anyway, I will talk to you tomorrow for five more minutes. How about that? Huh? Huh?